In the previous video lecture, we understood native page. In this method, proteins remain in their native form and therefore, we can also study biological activity of the proteins separated in native page. But, what if, we want to determine, molecular weights of proteins in a given sample? Or, if we want to find out, whether a given protein in a sample is composed of single subunit, or multiple subunits. To determine the molecular weight, or number of subunits of a protein, modified form of polyacrylamide gel electrophoresis is used. This technique is known as STS page. It is the most popular form of protein electrophoresis. In this method, proteins are first treated with an anionic detergent known as STS. Now, what is STS? STS stands for sodium dodecyl sulfate. As said before, STS is an anionic detergent. It carries a negative charge. Let's find out what happens when proteins are treated with STS. Suppose this is a protein molecule. Here, you can see that this protein is made up of two subunits shown by colors green and orange. When we treat this protein with STS, two things happen. First, the protein's intact structure get disrupted. Protein is denatured by STS. As a result, protein unfolds and subunits get separated. Second, the STS molecules coat the disrupted proteins. Approximately, the hydrophobic tail of one STS molecule associates with every two amino acid residues. This coating of STS molecules masks the original charges of the amino acid residues of the protein. Now, we also know that proteins may have disulfide bridges in their native form. To disrupt these bonds, a reducing agent such as beta mercaptoethanol is also added. Thus, as a result of this pretreatment of proteins with STS and the reducing agent, all the proteins in the sample acquire a rod like shape. Another important point is that, besides shape, the charge to mass ratio of all denatured proteins becomes nearly constant. Thus, now, all the proteins in this sample have same charge density and shape. The only parameter left for gel electrophoresis is the size or molecular weight. So, STS page separates proteins on the basis of their size or molecular weight. Larger the size, higher the molecular weight and slower will be the migration of this protein molecule. And small size proteins will migrate faster. So, in this video lecture, we understood two forms of polyacrylamide gel electrophoresis. These are, native page and, STS page. In native page, proteins remain in their original intact form. But in STS page proteins are first denatured using STS. The basis of separation of proteins in native page is the combination of their charge density, size, and shape. On the other hand, STS page separates proteins on the basis of their molecular weights. Native page is used for separation and detection of enzymes. And STS page is used for determination of molecular weights of protein. I hope this video lecture is helpful to you. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share and comment. Thank you for watching.